Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're gonna to start a new segment where we highlight a, a local brick and mortar store. So uh, this is the first in this segment. We're gonna be going in here in a minute to Jay Brooks Jewelers. They're an authorized dealer here in Murray, Utah. And uh, hope you guys enjoy this new segment. So this is Brooks Brandscomb. He is uh, part of the Brooks in the J. Brooks name of yeah. uh, this uh, jewelry store here, an authorized dealer. We've got Nomos on the table. Brooks is going to be running us by the brand. We're going to have a little conversation. Uh, but I want to thank you for having me in the store today. Happy to have you, man. Yeah. Thanks for stopping by. We really appreciate it. Brooks opened the store a little early so we can film without customers and stuff. Really appreciate that. It's a little and, easier. Uh, <laughs> yeah, for sure. So, so Brooks, tell us a little bit about Nomos, maybe what the name means, some of the things you like about the brand. I, I know it's a new pickup for your store. Yeah. Uh, and, and something that you've been wanting, a line you've been wanting to get for a long time, if that's correct. Yeah, uh, I've had the line in mind for about five, six years, been in contact with Nomos specifically about running them as a line here in the store, which is a lot of fun. Uh, bringing any new brand in is always a, a tough experience in a new market. Yeah. Utah is not a, a very large market, say like California or New York. So getting a really fun high-end line like this is very exciting for the you know the state here and a lot of fun there. Uh -huh. um, we've really enjoyed having Nomos uh, for the last little bit, but in terms of the line, they do a really fantastic job when it comes to the movements, the quality that you're going to get for what you pay. Obviously, as you saw sure. by your review video there. Yeah, we're in it today. And it, they ultimately give you a sense of fulfillment for the amount of money that you're spending on a watch. And by comparison to what you'd expect for an in-house movement brand, Nomos keeps the line generally under the $4,000 range. And in fact, generally in the two to $3,000 range on most pieces. Yeah. And you can entry line the brand at $1,360 right now on the uh, Ludwig Duo. So with that, I think that's pretty impressive for the fact that you're not, I mean, you're getting an in-house designed and manufactured watch and it's not just hey we're putting it together here in the Glashütte right. region of Germany right. they're actually manufacturing right. almost every component they're yeah. designing things they manufacture 95% of the movement uh, actually excuse me 95% of the entire watch not just the movement itself which is an important distinction because i feel like that's a uh, the point that you made was something that was designed you know built in china cased in switzerland yeah. uh, that's something that we see really common in the industry where people use overseas manufacturing and then they assemble it in switzerland or germany or whatever the, the country of origin is mm -hmm. but nomos is a very unique line where they design everything in berlin they build everything in glasuta uh -huh. so you get a very unique style overall from any of the other watch lines when it comes to what you're getting how they manufacture it and something that's even more interesting is say you take any of their neomatic models which is their automatic series they can actually produce these on such a large scale if they wanted to they could replace etta <laughs> Which is, that's huge. That is really cool. So it shows that their manufacturing capability is on par with some of the largest watchmaking houses in the world, but they're also providing a level of quality in the manufacturing and the finishing, especially if you've taken a close look at the Absolutely. movements, uh, for the value that, you know, obviously what you're going to pay, you're going to really reap the reward in terms of that over the years. I think it's just been a really fine piece and I'm really excited to see that uh, the new 6101 movement that you've got yep. uh, is officially out in the wild and we get to see it on people's wrists now. Now, So Brooks, what does nomos mean specifically? So nomos is a Greek term which means law and that's the direct translation as law. The looser translation, you know, obviously law and order, balance and all things, which is one of the reasons why you'll see that the dials are so in particular very clean, mm -hmm. very classic and honestly they're not over designed which is something that we do see a lot in the industry today yeah. with a lot of the different frills and garnish and you know, little things that they try to add on to really especially on dials make them pop and so for me to see something that's so simple but yet it's, pops it's organized and, and it's clean and exactly and sharp and very very organized is exactly the right word to use and if you'll notice on any of the gift with purchase bookmarks like you received uh -huh. The bookmark itself actually has all of the indices of a tangente dial separated. 
Really? And so they're yeah, very, exactly. yeah, they're very unique. Oh. So you can actually take all of the design elements and put them into a very clean, very simple line. And it creates a, a very unique design flow, which is something that I would say is not very common in the industry among any brands. Yeah. So I know, I, I know we've talked previously, you have a favorite that you're saving for, but uh, what is one that you have here in stock that you, we could highlight that, that you, you'd like to share with everyone here? So the Autobahn is probably the most unique piece that we have here in the store. Uh, I have another version of this coming in, uh, the Midnight Blue. So okay. It's another one that I want to see in person before I officially make my, my Nomos purchase. Gotcha. Uh, but I did get a chance to try it on in the Midnight Blue and it is absolutely stunning. But the Autobahn itself is just such a unique piece. It has these very unique dial and the very unique hands that were designed after a, Mercedes, a vintage Mercedes uh, dashboard. So the idea is that it looks you know, from zero to 120. That's awesome. And you can see it very cleanly. The hour hand is the larger of the hands, and then the minute hand is actually very thin. It looks almost like a second hand. And then you have your dedicated seconds below. And the date window is one that I always like when they open it up a little bit, yeah. where you get to see yesterday, today, and tomorrow, which I've always liked. Uh, just a beautiful design watch. I think that the lugs do a really great job. They're not too long. They do contour down so it fits onto the wrist really comfortably. Also, it's not very tall and the dial is just gorgeous. You'll have to get an additional shot of it because sure. it has a beautiful concave to it that when it lights up, when the loom is going, just spreads to the edge of the dial. Uh -huh. Absolutely stunning. What, what is kind of interesting, at least for me, is, is when, a, when a brand, a watch brand that uses an incredibly bold color and it can be overpowering and you look at the Nomos lineup, and I would say none of these are visually overpowering, but you look at small details like the, just the vibrant nature of the orange the that's orange, on there, orange, second hands. or on the club. I just love how they're able to take something that's strong and put it in their designs in a subtle way. I mean, it takes talent to do that. So they're Absolutely. obviously very into their design and their production and attention to detail. So, I mean, it's just such a great brand. I'm yeah. really glad that you guys picked them up here. Yeah, we're really happy to have them. They, they as Bruce was saying, you know, they, they live and they breathe the, the Bauhaus movement, which is less is more, uh, a German arts design style that is very unique and very fun. And you can see it represented in every one of the models. Even the more complicated models like the Zurich still hold true to the Bauhaus design movement. So it's very fun and we're very excited to have them here. And, you know, bring a, the Midwest a, a new fun brand before going to California or New York to purchase one. So. Exactly. So, so Jay Brooks Jewelers, they're here in Murray, Utah. That's the Salt Lake Valley. If you're in Utah, come on down to the store, meet Brooks, talk watches, try on Nomos. You guys also carry some other brands. You want to run by the other brands that you have? Yeah. Uh, being a family-owned business, uh, my father started the business about 24 years ago. We've been really loving it ever since. We've made it uh, our mission as a local family-owned business and you know, the next generation, me and my wife and my older sister taking over. Uh, we wanted to make sure that when we picked up a line and worked with any brand in particular, that we worked with a family-owned brand. And that doesn't matter whether it's watches, it's jewelry, it's diamonds, it's the whole nine for us. Because sure. we'd rather work with the same grouping of people that treat us like family as we treat them like family. And Nomos is a very fun line for us to have as they are a family-owned line. Uh, Roland Schwartner started the line back in 1990, yeah. which is a ton of fun. Uh, Bell & Ross is owned by Carlos Rocio and Bruno Bellamiche, who are both friends that met at a school when they are in about 7th, 8th grade, and just That's been cool. friends ever since. Huh. Uh, they've been around since 1992, originally starting with Sin, so you'll actually see old Bell & Ross actually say Bell & Ross by Sin on the dial. That's cool. The crowns will all have the Sin S, and huh. the buckles will all have the same thing. Huh. Uh, so their, their heritage and history in watchmaking is very fun and very unique, uh, but also independently owned, just like Nomos. Uh, as well, we do carry Oris and Karl F. Bukhara, which are both independent family-owned lines. Uh, the family for Karl F. Bukhara is no longer around, but the family is like did the same thing Rolex did. They put the company into a trust. Oh, gotcha. So it's trusted into the company. You know, nobody can take over. It's going to be designed and run to the ground, essentially, the way that they've always wanted it to be, which is awesome. Cool. They do very high-end movements from Karl F. Bukhara, lots of Etta mix matching, you know, lots of Dubois uh, components and whatnot. They do a really fun job. We've really, really been pleased with them. They've uh, we've carried them for 15 years almost. Yeah. So, 
Well, I'd, I'd love to come in on occasion and highlight either a, a Nomos or a Bukhara or a Bell & Ross. I think that'd be a really fun experience. And, Absolutely. And um, With a new BR05 coming in soon. Yes, that that'd looks awesome. Piece. That looks really good. So, so guys, again, if you're here in Utah, come on by, come meet Brooks, come look at the different brands they carry. Uh, but you also operate a website. So like yeah. if you're in an area where there is no authorized dealer in your state, uh, you can take a look at the stock that's on your website, give Brooks a call yeah. and say, hey, I need this uh, club sport or... Yeah, and we, we ship everything out next day, signature required. So that way there's no guesswork. Uh, makes your life very easy, tracking number sent out to your phone number or your email, whichever's preferred. Uh, and that's a nice way for you to make sure that you can get a quality product if your area doesn't offer it, if you're worried about gray market or anything like that. You know, don't hesitate, give us a phone call. I'm happy to help out with any need and we'll make sure that we find it appropriately for you, whether it's a brand new piece or if it's a pre-owned piece and we'll make sure to have fun and make it an enjoyable experience for you. Awesome. Well, thanks again, Brooke. Hey, it's been great. Good to see you. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. We'll catch you in the next video.